Now, in this question, what's involved is point Q. So point Q is in the elevation of the cone this time, and we have to find it in plan. Now, the problem with this type of question is, we bring down point Q straight down from your elevation down to plan. And the main problem with it is, we don't know where along that line. If we were to pick here, it's definitely going to be the wrong answer. Now, the reason it's going to be the wrong answer is, if it's down here, it's going to be very low down on the cone. Now, if we pick it on this point here, we know that's wrong. Why? It's on the side of the cone. And we already know point Q is not on the side of the cone. So, to answer this question, what we have to do is bring point Q across an elevation this time. So we're kind of working in reverse to the first question we did. So you bring it over here onto the side of the cone. Now we bring it over to the side of the cone, then we bring it straight down. Now, where is it in plan when we bring it straight down? Where it hits the centre line. Good. So it's here. Now, what we're going to do now in plan is rotate it. And in this question, we could rotate it two different ways. Now, which one's going to be the correct answer? Why? Exactly. It's on the front face in elevation. So if it's on the front face in elevation, it has to be rotated down. Now, if you're told in the question it's on the back face, you're actually rotating up here. Okay. So we rotate it down, and where it crosses over with the line brought directly down from Q. That there is point Q in plan.